Hello, Facebook, YouTube. Wow. How interesting God is. He's an interesting God. One thing about God, God is very interesting. Yes, He is. And if you're not come, you're not trying to be interesting of how God works, you're not going to really, really grasp the reality of the kind of person he is interesting person you know you all God will always be interesting to me because you know the thing is I can't we have no right to measure how God does things we have no right to see how God his ways are higher than our ways his thoughts are higher than our thoughts we don't have no right to you know measure God to our standard of the way we think and the way we do things and I learn that each and every day and every time, you know, I love each and every day to, you know, figure out this great God, you know, that created this universe. Well, he got something quite interesting for me, you know. Faith is, will be quite interesting, you know, uh, how, you know, where you position you you put you because you follow his will he placed you in places that you to places unfamiliar places and sometimes it's familiar to familiar you know it's kind of like it's one thing that abraham was at mount moriah and it's the other thing that you know david you know took you know jerusalem and now he has established you know, Zion on Mount Moriah, you know, but David is a seed of Abraham, you know, and when you're at a place where you was at a place, you know, <laughs> it's just quite interesting of how God operates things, but this is one of my favorite spots I ever been at to communicate with God, right here, it's Right here, this is a, this is, this is a very special tree here. This, I named this tree right here. This tree is called By the Tree. You know, his name is By the Tree. You know, like the scripture, by the, I shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water. Hey, this guy's a tree. And guess where he's planted at? In the rivers of living water. This is the Manatee River. The Manatee River. And this is the tree that's planted my, not only by the river, but kind of in the water. In the water, yeah. And the rivers of living water. And, you know, this is the guy I talked to. You know, I talked to by the tree when things are going crazy I go to buy the tree you know and I talk to him and say how do you stand by the tree you know by the rivers of living water you know how do you you know remain by the tree you know and you know he, he just tells me by his action this is how he do it he just do it you know what I'm saying by the tree, just do it. It's not just something that he have to, should have to explain. It's something I should just need to see and recognize and behold of he's there. But here's the thing about this. I am trying to mirror his image. I'm trying to be like that tree planted by the rivers of water, you know. I'm trying to mirror his image and fulfill my purpose that God has, you know, chosen me to do. But by the tree... You know, I talked about a tree and I complained about the things that are trying to move me from my purpose. And by the tree just sits there and I looked at it, you know, it doesn't have to say anything. But yes, yeah, you know, it, it, yeah, Mac, you're going through situations, circumstances. You're going through all this crazy, chaotic stuff in your life. But guess what? You just got to be. by the tree.
planted by the rivers of living water. You know what I'm saying? That's where you got to be, you know? You got to be there, you know? We, in spite of the situation, in spite of the circumstances, this faith is called faith. It's called the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things that are not seen. You have to see it for what it is, Mac. And guess what? You just have to do what it do when it do what it do. In spite of whatever opposition that comes in your life, you just be like this. By the tree, planted by the rivers of living water. Whoa! The stork comes flying out. <laughs> surprises, surprises. But I shall be by the tree, planted by the rivers of living water. I will bear forth fruit and I shall not be moved. I always quote that when I'm done talking to the tree. And the tree helped me get me straight, straighten me out. And let me know that, you know, this is spiritual, but this is not natural, you know, concerning my direction of my life to where I go. But it keeps me in line to let me know. But I ain't seen by the tree in a, quite a while concerning the journey I've been on. But, you know, the thing is, I came to visit by the tree, you know, and give it some doubt. Give it some doubt. Boop. Ha, ha. For helping me out to remain by the tree planted by the rivers of living water and bear, shall bear forth fruit and will not be moved. Hope you like me and my tree finna take a picture. Oh, uh, me and my tree by the trees taking a picture. <laughs> All right. I hope you ain't got the revelation by the tree. He can teach you a whole lot of stuff, can't you? By the tree, you can teach him, can you? Just be by the tree to be an example. That's it. That's all by the tree got to be for me to understand what I got to do when I got to do what I got to do. All right. To God be the glory to him forever and ever. In Jesus' name. Amen. By the tree. Ha, <laughs> ha.